Hey guys, it's Phaedra from allthingsphaedra.com and I am not in my normal location today. I'm coming to you from Riyadh, Saudi Arabia, and I was honored to be an invited guest here for the Formula E Prix. Now, if you're not familiar with this race, it's part of the FIA series of races. It's an all-electric, single-driver street race, and they have a course set up right here in the heart of Riyadh, and I'm gonna show you everything that I can, including all of the cars with representation from BMW, Audi, Jaguar, and more. The weather is a little bit unusual for Riyadh. It's sunny right now, but there was rain and it, it was a little unexpected. The track's very wet. And so unfortunately, we've already seen a few crashes this morning. It's a short 40 minute race and it's gonna be exciting to watch. I'll show you all the highlights. General Sport Authority is the one that contracted the General Sport Authority. So they, they invited me. They invited me? Yes. Well, Turkey, Alice, Turkey, Turkey, Alice, and Turkey, the president. So I have pretty great access here. I'm able to view the entire race trackside at the finish line. But while I'm waiting for the race to start, I'm checking out, it's called the Alliance E-Village, and this is for VIP ticket holders. It's kind of like all the stuff you might find at an auto show, cool little displays. And so I've just been checking it out, seeing how some familiar brands present themselves here. And I even got a chance to meet all of the drivers. happy for everyone back in Munich. Thank you so much. Thanks BMW. Thank you Jens. I did it. Yes. Uh, well, well done. Huge congratulations. So that was the Formula E Prix. Congratulations to Antonio Lacosta from Portugal, who is part of the BMW Andretti racing team. Came in first for the season opener of the Formula E Prix race here in Adira in Saudi Arabia. It was a really cool race. I've learned a lot about electric racing that I didn't know. First of all, you don't get the roar of the engines, which is kind of cool. I kind of like the whine of the electric motor. And also, you don't get the laps. The, it's actually a timed race, so it's a designated period of time, I think about 40 minutes. And then the last thing is, you don't find out how fast the cars go, it's you actually find out their output, which is kilowatt hours. So it was a very cool race. I got everything I needed, the crashes, the smashes, the photo finish. I'm so glad to be here, and I'm glad to bring it to you from Saudi Arabia. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed a look at the whole grounds of the race. It's quite
hosted an event here in the country, and I'd love to hear what you have to say. I'd love to hear your comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time on or near the track.